What's up guys, Zaf here back with some more on Muji. Uh, I've just recovered from my viral fever that I had. It took a few days off. Uh, it was really bad. And um, well, good news is we're back and uh, the game has a new update. Uh, let's see, let's see what updates they have. Uh, good notice. Right, uh, update announcements on the 28th of March. Um, they added the new R Shikigami, a new R rated Shikigami that you can get only from the shrine for now. Uh, it costs 200 talismans. Um, I, I already got one. I got one. Got him. Is it him, her? I have no idea. Probably he's a guy. Yeah, I got it. It's called Sagi. I uh, got him up to G4 because in the bio you can get one of these bios where you where, when you get him um, gives you a skill Daruma so all you have to do is just bring them out to G4 level 40 and you get that skill Daruma skills are pretty interesting I'm not sure though consumes uh, basically his uh, second skill here Usagi has 40% chance of gaining one carrot for up to four carrots when he takes damage he also gains two carrots at the start of his turn and one carrot at the start of, of battle. Each carrot increases Usagi's effect res by 20%. Carrots can, can't be dispelled. So it's uh, up to 60% chance of gaining a carrot and effect res up to 40%. Now when you get these carrots, right, um, his skill... So I'm guessing this is a passive skill and then he only has two skills, right? Which first skill is just normal basic attack, 100% of his attack power. Then uh, consumes all his carrots to dispel all paralyzing debuffs like freeze, daze, morph, and sleep, which currently can't be dis dispelled by the current dispellers that we have, it's like Amiona. So yeah, so this will bring uh, more mechanics to the game. Also increases the move bar of the ally by 10% or up to 30%. Double if the ally has any other debuffs. Each additional carrot consumed raises the move bar of an additional ally. Uh, I don't know. We'll, we'll have to see how people use her, him, her. I don't know. I can't. I can't tell. Is it a guy, girl? Probably a girl. Yeah. What else is there with the updates? Pretty cool unit, though. Uh, what else did come? Uh, Easter events. So we've got this frog blessing event. Right. Uh, let's have a look at that. So this event, uh, you have to go here to the wreck. Oh, no. that's not the one. What's happening? I, I did click on the event. Right, Frog Fortune Egg Happy Easter is from fourth. Uh, no, sorry, from four a.m. March twenty eighth till the till eleven fifty nine April third. So you got these frogs here, right? So you can click on each each one of it right so three times a day and you can get between these rewards so if you get this uh, like I got this two like really gold colored ones uh, so you have a chance of getting all these rewards you know Jade um, skin tickets um, G4 great Daruma um, AXP Daruma um, skill Daruma mystery amulet G5 moon and Orochi scales so yeah uh, depending on luck see what you get it's not bad I mean it's free stuff right what else do we get uh, daily free summon okay so this only happens on April Fool's onwards uh, 1st of April get two chances of using mystery amulets to summon and login on 2nd April and 3rd to get one free chance oh okay, yeah not bad uh, then also there's this bidding. So I logged in today and everybody was was crazy going like a red or blue and I was like well, what's happening? So basically you go to town Right and then there's this guy right here right beside the mystic trader showdown bidding So you click on him All right, and you got this two sh Two on Muji's that's fighting you know one has this lineup another one has this lineup and uh, when you click on them, right, it will show you the stats of the of the Shikigamis and it will show you the stats of the other team's Shikigamis, right? So then um, you bet based on which one that you think will win, right? So apparently I bet the, the red one earlier and uh, I won. So let's see what I got. 
Oh, 160k. Wow, that's not bad. Cool. So we press next. Uh, next bidding. Let's see who's who's fighting who. Got Kappa, Vampira, Omibuzu, Shishio, Oguna. Okay, so crit damage Umibozu right there. Hmm. Also a crit damage issue. Right, and he's fighting Homiona, Gaki, Chocho, Kamikoi, Kyonchi, Imoto. Really, is this a fight? I don't know, I'm, I'm going with the red one with Vampira and Umibozu because they have heals and, you know, they have damage and they've got uh, Shisho doing debuffs. And uh, what does Oguna do? Oguna has uh, the one, the, the, the full res, you know, sacrifices himself to revive all KO'd allies. So yeah, I'm gonna go with this one. Uh, I'm going in all in with uh, 300k. So winner receives Orochi scales and 120 jade. Or if you go with this one, 66 jade and two mystery amulets. Hey, hey. I don't know, man. 120 jade reverse scales, or do I get the mystery amulets? I think I'm, I'm gonna go with mystery amulets. All right. So different bets yield you different results. So I'm, I'm going with the mystery amulets one, just because I don't really need jade, nor reverse skills. I have, I have a lot of those. Cool. So that's how you place your bets. Right. Uh, what's happening next? Oh, and, and they, they, they do this every two hours. So every two hours, just come back, check it. You know, hopefully you have enough coins to to place your bid and get it. Right. What else do we get? Um, chapter 20 is unlocked uh, Once you clear chapter 20 on normal you get 50 jade Once you clear chapter 20 on hard you also get another 50 jade And the chapter is actually pretty simple And also the the, the credit yield from there The coin yield from there is not bad The new secret zone hopping rage is added To get Yama Usagi skin which is pretty cool uh, I'll show you guys Then after that you also have new skins on sale Which is for Oguna and Dojo and they've got this interesting limited Dharma packs on sale. Got the Dawn pack and also the April Fortune Cat, which we'll have a look right now. So let's go to more pack. Let's have a look, see. Coming in three days. So you got this frame, Dawn frame. Then you get one mystery amulet and you get 100 jade for 30 S jades. I guess it's not bad. How much is 30 SJ? 30 SJ is 3 bucks. Alright, so essentially you get a frame, one mystery amulet, and 100 J for 3 bucks. That's not bad. And you also get the April Fortune Pack, which gives you a frame. Uh, and for 30 days, you get 20 J, which is essentially 600 J. And you get 30 base to romance, one a day. And 15% EXP bonus, so I'm sure this 15% EXP bonus stacks. Stacks with your 100% EXP, stacks with your 50% EXP. And also a 15% coin up bonus for 50 SG. Um, I, might, I might get both these packs. So this is for 50 and this is for 30... 30, yeah, 80, 80 SGs altogether, which comes up to about 5, 3, 8 bucks. It's not bad, I guess. I guess it's not bad. I guess it's really not bad. What else do we have? Uh, we have the bunny secret zone, which um, I've already cleared up to stage nine. Um, then I tried. I tried doing stage ten, and I just got wrecked. Uh, basically, the team that I went in with was. Um, I'll show you guys. Oh, they also had that. Did you see that loading screen? The, the Easter egg one? So basically, this was a team that I used. Uh, I used Ibisu, Momo, Shuzu, Samurai X, and Utengu. Uh, it did fine from like stage 5 to stage 9. I cleared 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 with it, I think. Before that, I was just using double pull. But as I got to this stage, you know, I just got wrecked because, um, you know, my guy's not tanky enough. The, the stats are not good enough for it. Or I could just be using a wrong strategy altogether. But yeah, I'll, I'll figure it out. You know, like um, most of it, I'm stuck at at stage ten. You know, <laughs> you can see I've only cleared one of Momiji and also Blade Secret, which is the the two easiest dungeons. The rest of it are, are pretty tough to clear for the skins. But yeah, the the rewards are not bad. 
um, and also don't forget uh, if you're going in and they have coin rewards okay what you can do is turn on your coin bonus that's a coin bonus 100% right and as you go in and when you do it you will get double the, the coin bonus so that means if you do the 10,000 one you get 20 50,000 one you get 100 and when you do the 100,000 one you will get 200,000 and also this this 330 will, will change to 5 uh, 660 um, 540 420 so on and so forth yeah so so I guess that's it for the updates I think is there anything else I'm um, gonna look at summons the shrine yeah you can get the usagi here you can see there's no limit to getting it you can just keep buying and buying it to skill him up skill her up him or her up I have no idea I'm also right now a shrine ticks I only have 400 ticks left mmm I mean, basically, I bought it because I wanted to do the bio so that I can I can scale up Susabi. Uh, that's who I've been working on currently. Um, Susabi. I was excited because I got three skills into the third skill, so I tried again, and and the next two went to the first and the second skill. So yeah, I think I think this game is just messing with me. You know, what's gonna happen is they're gonna max the first skill, gonna max the second skill, then only the last one will go here for sure. I know it, man. The game is just teasing me. But yeah, that's it guys for the updates. Um, that's it. Anything else for the updates? I'm not sure. Is there anything else? Chapter 20. Right. Uh, what else is there? Yeah, I think that's about it. And, and also there's the, of course, the Royal Battles, which... This week's Royal Battle. I didn't do last week's Royal Battle, but this week's Royal Battle is pretty cool. Um, they finally bought uh, Kamaitachi in so the fastest that you can bring Kamaitachi to is only 237 speed though so there will be people that will be faster still like um, Shishio and Maestro and who else? who else is faster than that? Hmm, I think um, Hangen is faster I think yeah Hangen is faster Yeah, that's about it. Like, they even brought Ibaraki in. So yeah, so you can have like your dream Ibaraki going like, you know, 290 crit damage, 100% crit rate. And see how he does. But yeah guys, uh, that's it for the updates. Uh, I will be bringing you guys more videos, hopefully, uh, in this coming few days. This is Zaf signing out then.